Those who buy now and pay later. Payment later plans welcome tough new rules introduced by the government to crash industry. Deputy Treasurer Stephen Jones announced that the government will introduce new regulations to accommodate other forms of credit. Like thousands of Australians, Newcastle student Mark Pace found that he paid back more than bargains upon purchase, now paying later services to buy food, clothing and medicine. Assistant Treasurer Stephen Jones Pace told Current Issue, I had to pay 50 a week to steal them and actually own the account and have debt recovery. Tara Lowe said she's building her business into the Buy Out Now payment plan, but she's also seen the ugly side. Newcastle student Mark Pace We didn't get another penny from them one evening and the bag still had to fulfill all the orders and we never saw a penny, he said. The low still owes about 75000 from the collapse providers. Tara Lowe said she bought her business now. By now then disrupted consumer finance worldwide when the industry was founded. Consumers can easily use the service without having to jump through the same hoops as their credit cards, but it didn't take long before cracks began to appear. It has been operating in Australia since 2018 without extensive checks and balances. New rules have been introduced that are hard to buy now. ASIC found that 20% of people who used it missed a payment. On top of the personal going debt came corporate crashes like OpenPay, and cowboy operators left the industry with millions of indirects. People are sold on irrecoverable debt, there are no checks and balances, and people find themselves in a difficult financial position in a life crisis, Tonkin said. Consumer advocate Gary Mortimer believes the changes will clean up the industry. The people who will be concerned about tighter regulation will be young consumers, Mortimer said. He believes tighter regulations will see smaller players exit the market because they won't see long-term growth. Consumer advocate Gary Mortimer But Mortimer believes the larger acquisition will keep later businesses around. They can reinvent themselves, they can switch to credit cards, he said. The changes are expected to go into effect later this year. The assistant treasurer added, We don't want to make it harder for people who use by now, then pay as intended, but we want to make sure we raise the bar.